Hi, I thought like to help you guys a bit who, who are going to appear for IELTS exam. Uh, whoever, I mean, whoever in South Asia, I think I, give, I can give you a little bit of tips how I prepared for IELTS within 20 days. Yes, 20 days, you heard it right. I left my job. First of all, I left my job because I felt like now these days IELTS are not that easy that it used to be. I mean, IELTS is not easy if you are not good at English and uh, I mean especially if it's your you're not using English every in everyday life or your speaking term is not frequently used it will be pretty hard for you so let me come I, I don't want to take you too much time so I will make it short I will show you some of the channels which may be which may come very handy to for you if you're appearing for IELTS within one month or so it will be very quick but you have to give enough time let's say you have to study every day at least three hours with uh, full concentration your perseverance is really really required here so let's start number one IELTS Lise this is IELTS Lise her channel doesn't uh, upload any video uh, anymore but whatever she has uh, it's good enough I mean um, I think she's the IELTS godmother for the preparation she has everything starting from um, listening to uh, writing everything she has over here and uh, she has in total how many videos I don't know where can I see the video anyways whatever the material she she has over here you have to go through every single if you want to really learn how to do I mean at least how to do a basic uh, you know how to get prepared for the basic uh, she she is the best one I can this is she's the top one and also if you know the basic uh, you can polish yourself so IELTS Lease is number one then it will come the IELTS Express all so here the IELTS Express this is a fantastic channel I would say they do uh, the uh, like from my uh, um, observation they uploaded last five months ago but they have really really good material especially I followed all the writing style materials and um, all the uh, vocabulary and so and so most of it was taken from IELTS Express their uh, writing task tips tricks example writing they have some really really good example writing and I what I did in my case you know it's a little bit hard some in the sum of the part they actually explain but when they gave the full writing in a video you know it became it it, it became fragile um, I mean it 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 actually uh, the, it pixelate not for you pixelate pixelated so uh, you have to give some effort to understand the writings but other than that everything preparation for writing this is one of the best channel I will say number three uh, IELTS coach so this guy gave the best tips for vocabulary and idioms uh, idioms and phrases and all kind of preparation for those things you need in writing and speaking both so uh, the IELTS coach is really good for you know boosting your scores in speaking and writing both he has some really good quick tips follow those he doesn't have much videos but a really good one then South Asian people as I said whoever is getting prepared for IELTS within next one or two months Manjita Osta, I hope I'm pronouncing correctly, she's an Indian girl and she gives really, really, really good tips in IELTS speaking. If your IELTS speaking is nearby, I would say quickly go through her every single videos where she gave the tips for speaking. She's really good at this and within very short time uh, she explained very nicely and her videos are not that long very short and she gives just on the point 
she gives the tips so follow that one and she she also like she's uploading regularly like eight eight hours ago she uploaded a video 30 new words in 30 days that's great i mean she gave a plan actually a plan for your whole ielts test how to get prepared so my suggestion will be get prepared for your ielts if you're not too good, not so good at english i would say take two months you will be fine then uh, the next one is very interesting it's fast track education this is the best one for speaking this lady is from uk she's origination probably chinese or some other place not chinese not some anyways wherever she's from but she's living in uh, uk for eight years that's what she said in her video she's a teacher and her experience is really good i mean that came really handy especially for reading i followed her tips for reading and her reading tips are awesome follow her she has a lot of videos and also she gave some really helpful um tips and tricks for 2018 i mean she's got a quite updated one like she used like day tips and um, how to get prepared and what to do what not to do also is uh, she gave very good uh, tips for speaking as well fast track education that was another one then IELTS energy TV I use very little but I followed this woman where she said do's and don'ts she's very good at that because she's a native one she said I mean she gives you the tips what natives do and non natives can't do that i mean they can't follow that i mean uh, we uh, our native language is not english so we don't understand a lot of things which actually english speakers they use so some are outdated some are not outdated so those are the things she will teach you over here she has a couple of very good videos i mean she's also updated three days ago she up uploaded one so the next one is listening okay i kept the listening at the last because listening test is practice 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 so this is the ielts listening practice test so the channel looks like this these uh this is one and the second one is i followed the official ielts listening test they upload every single day okay this they upload every single day and they upload this one the IELTS listening practice test, they uploaded several, I, I, followed, I, I uh, solved a couple of them and they uploaded the most hardest listening test ever I have seen. Like it's very hard to even, you know, bring up 30, 28, something like that. So I would say the harder you, uh, the hard, hardest one you practice is better for you. I mean, you will get used to with the easy one. So if you're like shouldn't be that hard i mean the kind of practice they do but it will be fine and this one the uh, official ielts listening test they also upload every day different kind of practice listening is absolutely depending on your practice because it is actually how much attention you're paying or uh, that is the test actually in listening so uh, they also upload some speaking session video i mean these are not made these are probably real listening test i'm not sure but i have gone through the what i found very handy this video this was from 2018 and she this lady scored band nine and trust me i followed the full format of her in my speaking test and i found it very very handy this one was a couple of years back i mean this one probably was in 2016 but this one is in 2018 and trust me this is a very good format the sound is a little bit bad i mean how did they do the video i don't know i does video i i have no idea uh, probably it was a band nine that's why they uploaded the video but you know i all i know they do the recording so you can follow the they, they, they do sometimes uh upload the speaking session i don't know how do they get the um video because I felt like these are real IELTS exam because that is how the real IELTS exam uh, speaking session uh, is done. So yeah, that's it for me.
for from my side i would say if you're a working person take two months practice 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 we find uh, like uh, especially the english speaker who are like using english every day let's say there are some some of the people are working in uh, multinational companies or international companies so you think like oh i'm good at english why would i need to practice trust me you need one ielts has a really different kind of format it's not our educational kind of writing format or speaking format they have a very specific speaking format uh, for the test they have very specific writing format for the test so do practice do follow and you will be fine my result didn't came out but it will be uh, on in may so but that is how i just wanted to say how i i just wanted to share that how i prepared myself but i gave the full concentration because i left the job and i i could give the full fledged my time my full fledged time and uh, i studied every day more than 3 hours you won't believe more than 3 hours because the kind of job i used to do there was no time for myself or anything so i thought like okay leave the job and then i, I will see what happens but i kept the option that if i do uh, bad or maybe not it won't be i mean i believe i gave a very good exam my exam was today so i thought like to it it's better to you know always help someone who is panicking at the moment for the uh, exam so that is how i got prepared for 20 days and i think i was good so yeah that's it if you have any question if you want to know something more if i have used if i missed i don't know but uh, you always can knock me and i'll be very happy to help you thank you